What's up, guys? Welcome back to GTA Vice City Stories Gang Hate playthrough. Now, in this recording session, the goal is to get past Umberto Rabina's missions, then hopefully getting past those two missions of Louise. Uh, I think. Yeah, hose the hose and. Robbing the cradle. Okay, let's get a move on before I board you guys again. Hey, stranger, you dead me. Heh, <laughs> Vic even says something when he doesn't even aim a gun, just with your fists. Okay, pit with weapons. Let's do this. As you may have saw in the last recording session, yeah, Fort Baxter soldiers striked again. They sh they struck me with their fucking M4s. Those damn arseholes. Poppy, don't screech. What? Who the hell is gonna pay for that? You, bud. You're gonna be the one paying for it, bitch. You wanna swim with sharks? You're messing with the sharks. <laughs> Let's hope no donkey dick soldiers get in the way. Havana good time shouldn't be hard. Even though I cannot use auto aim, so that's gonna be unfortunate. Oh fuck you very much. Now we're going to have a heck of a time getting there now. Fort Baxter soldiers. Ah, ah motherfucker. At this point, the car is fucked. Yeah, that was unfortunate. Fucking Fort Baxter soldiers like totaled my fucking vehicle. God damn it. Okay, uh. Vic, calm down. No, you calm down, prick. That was unfortunate. Stupid Fort Baxter soldiers. You back up quick. You want oh fuck you. Intelligent. 
Out of the way, people. I'm coming through. Ah! So shite. Piece of shite. Not explaining words right now. Everyone's on the monkey juice in this playthrough. Ow! You bitch! Yeah, this mission's becoming a bitch. Your crashing is still irritating. I don't feel too good. Oh shit, move away. At this point, this car is fucked. Take it easy, my heart. I think, even without the gang weapon upgrade mod, I think this gang hate playthrough is probably harder than the Vice City one. Probably, the Vice City stories version. Oh yeah, the GTA 3 one would be even harder, honestly, because the gang behavior is just ruthless in that game. The reason why it wouldn't work out for San Andreas, because when you have the pedestrians attack you cheat on, it actually has impact on the NPCs during missions, like mission-specific pedestrians. Like Big Smoke, Sweet, Ryder, for example. They'll get out of the car and try to fight you. And it, and it will make it impossible to to uh, get to the marker. Because the marker isn't even there. So you can't really progress through the mission because of them being out of the vehicle. If, it's, if I just make the gangs themselves hostile towards me. The only problem with that is that... So the... Ow. Shit. I did not know that, really. How does he get a heart attack when I leave him? Oh, so anyways. When I was, what I was saying is that... That the gangs in San Andreas, like, even if I set them to hate me... Their hostility basically gets turned off during missions. I mean, the worst they do is, like, trash your vehicle. I mean, they can still attack you if you, like, fire a gun around them. God damn it. Why are they, like, patrolling the streets? That shouldn't be their damn job. I actually never knew that. When you, when you like, abandoned the vehicle, the stress bar still goes up. Fuck the Empire Sykes for now. <laughs> Should've just went straight to my, uh, one of the Empire sites to save. Such as this one. I'll get body armor for the next mission. Don't act like a low life bit. 
Oh, come on, man. Oh, yeah, those are the illegal business. Fans crime family. I have a feeling that... I have a feeling that the ones that... That have baseball bats and pistols, I think they actually replaced the trailer park mafia. So they, like, fill in for the trailer park mafia. So, yeah. Oh, jeez. I'm on a good time. So I ask you once more. Are you mad? Yeah. Then why are you not like Bob? Because I totally am mad. Because I... My men are going to collect a little gift for the Cholo. They'll meet up. Nothing really disables the aggressive driver's cheat other than uh, reloading your save file. Actually, fuck, I'm staying in the vehicle. Ah, piece of shite. Piece of shit. Auto... Manual aim is a little difficult to deal with on console, you know. Take two, man. I should... My men are going to go 
shit, I need body armor. Okay, let's kill those sons of bitches. Honestly, I may just stay in the vehicle. Vehicle kills are allowed, just not auto-aim. Oh, my car disappears. Sure, it's a gun. God damn. We got what we came for. We're gonna go back now, okay? Not too many of them. They're just gonna keep spawning. I should know my routes by now, you know. Well, joke's on them. I'm over here, bitch. Let's hope the four Baxter soldiers don't fuck me in the ass. Where the fuck did you come from? You better get out, bitch. I guess they, they are good at finding you.
Guess another ch Oh my gosh, I'm glad those guys are a little farther away. <laughs> my friend, today is a good day. It's okay, taking life turns me on. Fuck you very much. Don't act like a low life, big. Well, that was a little difficult there. Part where you have to fend off a bunch of uh, those bitch cholos. Hose the hose. Let's get body armor first. You want to swim with sharks? Uh, any empire sites for sale? Oh fuck yes, let's go after it. Before they take it, you know. That's actually perfect. Right next to the mission marker too. <laughs> uh, let's not jinx it. Because it might be taken over by the time I get over there. You know how quickly they can take it over? Like super fucking quick. The reason why the Fort Baxter soldiers didn't attack. Because I was actually farther enough away from them. To the point where they didn't attack. If I moved closer, they would have attacked. Okay, let's do prostitution. Uh, let's do high roller, baby. Yeah, sharks do bite, fool. Uh, I'm moving farther enough away from them and oh my gosh, they caught up with me. They really do have legs to run, huh? They attack each other, not me. I have a feeling that the Fort Baxter soldiers are actually uh, neutral to like everyone, every other gang. I think they're not hostile towards any gangs whatsoever. I guess for I guess the Leaf Links golfers are considered regular pedestrians, even though they can still technically be gangs in this game.
Doesn't like Vic sleep with that prostitute or what? I have no idea, man. I have no idea what this game even is anymore. Let's get a kick ass ride, man. Who's the hose? Hey Louise! Did you call the fire department? Don't worry. I know where we can get a fire truck. Vic, chill the fuck out. Shit, man. You can actually... You can actually ditch Louise, actually, so... Yeah. Yeah, the analog stick actually controls the... F controls the hose of the fire truck. Well, oh my gosh, it went down like so fucking quick. God damn it. Did you see how quick that bar was going down? Like, oh my gosh. That went down like ridiculously fast. Holy fuck, man. That's gonna make the mission impossible. No way I can t put out a fire that quick. God damn. Yeah, I think those guys replaced the uh, trailer park mafia. Hey, That's why I don't see them anymore. Did you call the fire department? Look how fast the bar's going down. Holy fuck, man. Did they make this mission impossible on a emulator? Ah! Fuck you. Ah, fucking Fort Baxter soldiers were there. God damn it, this mission's gonna be a bitch. I am not going to enjoy this mission during my six stars playthrough, that's for sure. Honestly, the mission actually was difficult during my s practice run of my six stars playthrough. Honestly, the mission might be easier on the regular PSP, but on a PSP emulator, it seems harder due to, like, a better frame rate or something. You're good at pissing me off. Yeah, you tell him, Vic. 
Guess I'm gonna have to speed run this mission. I'm wondering how this mission will turn out during my sick my later six stars playthrough, which won't happen for a while. Hey Louise, it's me. Did you call the fire department? Don't worry. I know where we can get a fire truck. Well, get in the car then. You see how fast that bar's going down? Holy shit. The fire truck isn't that great in this game. Probably better than it is in Liberty City Stories. Marty's cousin! He did it! Yeah, no gang members. Well, he does have six toes. Now he now he has no toes to work with. The, oh, gosh. Uh, yeah, yeah, Fort Baxter soldiers. Yeah, just, just face away. Now, during a Six Stars playthrough, I would not stay in the middle of the road. Try to hose down a freaking empire site. I would not do that because. Who the hell is gonna pay for that? That'd be fucking risky, really. I would just take the back entrance of it. I would go behind the empire site. I think Shark Spikers and the Fort Baxter Soldiers will be the only ones that will, I mean, and the Vance Crime Family. Those gangs will always attack you. Robbing the Cradle. Uh, do we have time for that? Let's check our, uh... Oh yeah, we have time. That mission's going to be a huge fucking problem in my uh, six star, later Six Stars playthrough, that's for sure. I mean, stealing a fire truck right in the middle of the road would be very difficult with Six Stars because... Mainly because tank occupants usually don't get out. And they'll, fuck, they'll fucking run into you with, uh, without hesitating. They're not like the ones in... Uh, and other GTAs where most of the time they get out. In this game, yeah, they'll run you over. Oh man, I gotta swim with sharks, huh? Robbing the cradle. Vic. Going? So soon? Honestly, hose to hose is actually like a little harder on a PSP emulator. I think due to a better frame rate, I think. I think a lower frame rate might actually like make the bar go down slower. There's more white trash, guys. Oh shit. Or at least they won't attack me with the cops around. Hey, I might just kill. 
<laughs> what the fuck? Oh, I got busted. Ah, oh, gosh. I didn't want to get busted. God damn, that's such an embarrassment, really. Gosh, Fort Baxter soldiers. Yeah, you better walk that way, you pricks. More like you gotta clean your cock every day. Vic. You gotta clean your cock, sweetheart! Yeah, I'm just joking, but still. Where's it? Bike. Give me that bike, bitch. Yeah, you hardly see a cop car actually chase you in this game since they disappear so easily. Okay, I need to get my hit in the game, man. Ah, fuck, I'm out of... I need to pay attention to my ammo, do I? Did I get ultra copped? What the hell happened? Oh yeah, door got chipped off. Okay, I need to get more ammo. I'm trying too hard. Yeah, you might be asking me, how the hell are you going to do a six stars playthrough of this game when you can't even do it with gang members everywhere? I'm like, I'll oh, shut up you. Yeah, I need more micro Uzi ammo. I'm like unprepared, seriously. Third time be a charm. Nothing but weak gangs here, huh? Oh, yeah. Very intelligent. Before doing hostile takeover, I'm going to uh, develop a high roller drugs empire site, and what the hell happened to that car? Unless we can find a reliable micro Uzi ammo, which we probably won't. Perfect. Yours. Okay, sweet cheek, let's get this over with. Vic.
Every, no one's your friend in this playthrough. I shouldn't be a sitting duck because they can be attacking. Somebody help! Fucking fuck. What is up with my luck, man? Ah, do you know what? I'll just end this recording session. Well, that's it for this video, and see you next time.